car literally stopped. Today is going to be a little bit scary for me. Um, for a quick summary, I thought for the longest time that I wanted to be a nurse and so I took a CNA course after high school and worked at a hospital. And I thought that's what I wanted to do with the rest of my life. I could see myself, you know, working at the hospital because if you guys are in any type of medical career, um, it's not boring. It's not a desk job. And, um, it's really exciting. And that's what I thought I liked. Um, it wasn't the fact that what nurses do bored me. It was the fact that I didn't want to have to wake up every day and work for someone else. I wanted to work for my, I want to work for myself. And I just didn't see myself being a nurse and working for myself. And given the fact that I just woke up and I have no makeup on, this blurring effect came in handy. But anyway, um, so I talked to my parents because they're like my number one supporters and of course my husband. And they've always inspired me to kind of just go and do what I want to do. And let me tell you, that shit is scary. Um... But my dad owns a DJ company and I was the one who really wanted to get hands on and do his logo and create his website and I'm still working on those things. But I realized I love doing that. Like that's what I want to do. So I'm going to go to the education center and talk to a counselor and see when they can get me started. Uh, the reason I haven't started college is for another personal reason that I can't disclose right now, but hopefully in a couple months I'm gonna be able to tell you guys. So basically, I'm going to go get ready now to go talk to the counselor, and we'll see what happens. I think my cactus might be blooming. Oh my God, she's growing a bit sideways though. Okay, I'm on my way to uh, the education center, that annoying sound is my car. I'm in the midst of fixing it. Um, basically, I'm just gonna go to the education center and see what's what, what they can do for me. Okay, we're good. I think I know where the education center is. Yeah, I think I do. Um, turns off. Jesus! Ugh. Okay, okay. We made it. I can burst into tears. Okay, I obviously can't take you guys with me because uh, this is army stuff and we're not allowed to film on post and stuff that's related to the army. So I'm gonna have to leave you guys here. Wish me luck, everyone. I love my idea. The website doesn't even tell me the, the time that it closes, so we're just gonna pray. We're just gonna pray that my car gets me there. We're gonna pray that they still see me. We're gonna pray that it's still open. And we're just going to continue to pray that I don't mess up again. <sighs> I drove all the way over here 
lost my ID. Drove all the way back home. Couldn't find my ID. Threw down. Ruined my entire apartment. Found my ID. Came back all the way over here. For them to tell me. Well, first of all, I had to wait 40 minutes. That's so cool. I don't mind that. That's normal. Um, to see a counselor for five minutes. For him to tell me that not only can he not help me, but I could have done everything online. And, get this ladies and gentles, my CAA scholarship, which I just found out what that was, doesn't really cover this portion of, or this career that I want, this graphic design stuff. Which I'm pretty sure is a lie because I looked it up. But, you never know, I'm not a counselor. So now I have to drive my bitter ass home in a car that is about to turn off again. So that's awesome. Hopefully I make it there. When I graduate, <laughs> When I am successful, I'm going to remember to go back to this exact vlog. Because damn, it could be worse, it could be way worse. My car could actually break up, break apart, but it's not. It's holding together, it stopped his antics, and we're gonna get through this, right Vinny? Ooh, almost there, almost there. My car literally stopped. Come on. Almost there. We're literally right almost there. Ooh, I can't actually. Yeah. <clears throat> <sighs> well, oh, this lighting. I have pr practically made my house a mess. Because I tore this whole place apart. Just trying to look for my ID. Um, but basically the guy said that he couldn't do much for me. And that I have to get everything online. And that I should make phone calls to these numbers. And he gave me a paper filled with a bunch of numbers. And I have to call the university. And so I guess the journey begins. So... <sighs> Okay, so I'm in my room and I switched into something more comfortable because I know I'm going to be on the phone for a long, long time. So let's begin. Hi, yes, my name is Gianni. I'm, I'm sorry, could you spell that again, please? I just need some more information on this. My Hi, my name Hi, is Gianni. Hi, Emily. Is there any like, no, I didn't know. I would just like more information. I'm on hold. <sighs> That's about as far as I think I'm gonna get today. Didn't go to the gym today, why you may ask? Why didn't we go to the gym today? Why didn't we go to the gym today? Because we got lazy and hungry. We were supposed to say that it, was, it got too cold. Oh. So uh, my plan was to help actually do dinner, but he came home early and was hungry and decided to move along with that. We're having the veggie burgers that are vegan and maybe a side salad because that does I've never had these so we shall see. Yee yee. Really? Mm -hmm. Ooh, I cannot wait to try mine. I didn't like the veggie burg the vegan burger because it was too beany and I don't like beans and I'm a very picky person and I feel like I failed as a healthy meal today. So I'm just gonna have this bottle of ketchup that I'm almost out of for breakfast. I mean for dinner. Him on the other hand loved it. 
I'm about to go take a shower and I'm about to go to sleep uh, because I'm tired. So that's going to be it for today. And I hope you had fun watching my multiple breakdowns. Bye.